In this video, I'm going to show you how to export an STL file from an image stack using Fiji. So first we're going to navigate to our Fiji download folder and in it is going to be the ImageJ application. Double click on that to open it and you'll get a menu that looks like this. From here, we're going to go to File, Import, Image Sequence. Navigate to the folder that has your image sequence in it, preferably 8-bit. And then click OK to load it. I've already loaded mine. What I have here is a series of 1,800 images of an ant eater, a giant ant eater's foot bone that we're going to try to export as an STL file. We're going to start with the post processing. So we're going to go to Process, Subtract, Background. Now, because I know that my bones are lighter than the dark background, we're not going to check light background. And for most instances, the 50 pixels is enough, but feel free to play with this by adding more or less if the image doesn't come out as you were expecting. We're going to go ahead and click OK. Next is we're going to create a threshold for the image. And how we're going to do that is we're going to go to Image, Adjust, Threshold. Now, usually the auto on this is pretty good, but feel free to play with the threshold amount here. Give it a little bit less, give it a little bit more. We found a happy medium at about 25. Going to hit set and apply. So in this case, what we don't want is to calculate the threshold for each image because we have a couple of outlier images. So we're just going to uncheck that and click OK. Give it just a minute to set. There we go. Next up, we're going to export this image to the 3D viewer. So we're going to go into Plugins, 3D Viewer. <clears throat> so because we're exporting this as a surface, we're going to want to change the display as to surface. Color, we want it to be white, but that is optional. Threshold, 50 is about good. Resampling factor, this is how high quality of a model we're going to get. So if you wanted a one-to-one -one with your scans, you would hit one in the resampling factor. But I'm running this on a laptop, so we're going to go up quite a bit. And hit OK. Pull in our 3D viewer. And let Java do its thing. And after a few minutes of thinking, our computer will render the 3D model. Once our 3D model has loaded, we're going to go to File, Export Surfaces, STL Binary. And from here, it's as simple as saving your file.